All right, so what is good, everybody, on YouTube? This is, of course, your boy, B, Bullet RC, coming at you guys again with, hold on, yet another video, and we are in the building today because little did I know, I checked my email a couple days ago, and, you know, being the frugal boy myself, Nike sends over a nice email saying, Hey, what's going on, boy? We heard you're cheap as fuck. Here's a 30% off code to all of our Nike factory stores and is valid between November 2nd and November the 6th. Now, don't feel fucking special because we also sent this out to other people. So if they're watching this right now, you should go ahead and check your email to see if you got that message too. So today's mission is, of course, we have to get the 30% off code. We have to hit up the Nike outlet. I haven't been in a while, so it'll be nice to get back out there. I'm just letting y'all know right now, home, because I got to... I gotta take this off. I'm sorry for the, the weird, weird uh, uh, movement of the camera. The rough edges, but listen, bruh. This is what I have waiting on me. If I don't get this stuff done before I have to go to Long Beach for Complex Con, I have all of this. All of these packs, bruh. They are literally waiting for me when I get home. Got some stuff from Grail, got some stuff from Supreme, Preve, a whole bunch of stuff that just landed in my P.O. box. So just, just know, blessings. Kith is in here too, just know, blessings are to be had and since i am leaving this weekend that means today is going to be a chill cozy work day and what i mean by a chill day a chill work day is that the fit i'm gonna chill out because it's 77 degrees outside fall is trying to creep up but that va weather is saying no bro it's 80 degrees today and i'm gonna have the chill fit on but we are still working so first up we need to hit up the outlet see what's going on hopefully i can find something and also i need to show you guys everything that i got at round two if you guys missed that video and once again bro shouts out to everyone that left a positive comment or a constructive keyword constructive comment on that round two video a lot of y'all guys really like that last drone shot and to be honest that last drone shot was actually an accident i did not mean for it to go like that i just wasn't trying to crash it so i kind of linked it to the left and who knew it was just gonna work perfectly so listen first up we need to hit that outlet and then i will bring it back if we cop anything i'll show that off and i need to show everything that we got from round two because like i said man there's no l's in this building there's no l's on this channel anyone that watches me there's no l's you do not take l's remember you take no l's only delayed w's it is time to hit up the outlet let's get it uh -huh, uh -huh. you know we back right uh -huh, uh -huh. clear the streets out uh -huh. Uh -huh. Come on with it. <laughs> Star Trek. Cause it's haters. I'm doing deals like the majors. Ice cream sneakers, I signed my first skater. So you could pay three and buy yourself some babesters. Bulletproof on the t-shirts because they hate us. Dude like Snoop say step your game up. Double deck a boat, let it to rain up. Cuts, tuck your chain up Liberace fingers Just hit Lorraine up Just last week I was out in Aspen Me and Puff hopping off the plane Both us laughing the Week before that I was out in Italy Retired heart throbs could not get rid of me Alright y'all so we have made it to the outlets And hopefully the frugal boys can come away victorious today Y'all see the big Nike sushi in the back. I got to peel off the camera so it'll focus But the big Nike sushi in the back So we are here We are live and honestly, I wanted to get here a little bit earlier when they open. They open, I think, at like 10 or 11. Right now, it's about 4 o'clock in the afternoon. So the early bird, the not-so-early bird, is now up trying to get a worm. So we're going to see what happens. I'll be right back. I'm down in telecrib, me and like 10 hoes. Call from the cell phone, give me that enzo. All right, y'all, so we are live at the outlets. Y'all see the swoosh. I don't know what time it is. All right, y'all, so we are live inside the outlets, the Mecca. So what's going on right now? is I feel like a lot of the stuff out here is just regular outlet stuff. Y'all know I try to come to outlets like maybe once, twice a month. Sometimes I don't record just to kind of check it out. I mean, the best thing I'm seeing right now are these like Teleria chill boots. So y'all already know, I ain't copping those. I mean, it's a real good deal. These are usually 225 bucks. They're on sale for 70. Y'all already know I got my Teleria fix though. They got some like foam geodome boots. I'm pretty sure some people, some people's want to cop these up. And plus I got an extra, 30%. So I want to try to find something. I need something. I need to walk out with something. Even if it's just like some tech fleece shorts or something. So let me look around real quick and we're going to come right back. I know what you're thinking. Yeah, me too. Okay. Everybody meet Mr. Me too. Been two years like I was paddy wagon cruising. Okay. So I checked out a couple of racks. I'm not finding a lot on the regular racks, but we did walk over to the shelves and already 
I see a thing that a lot of people, a lot of people slept on. The Wool 3s. I don't know how long these joints have been around, but they've been around for a long time. And they are in here in size 13. I don't see the price though, but whatever they are, it's an extra 30. So they don't sell for 160 I see plus an extra 30, which still seems kind of expensive for a shoe that has been sitting around for, I feel like almost two years now, but listen, we're finding J's though. I'm out here, we finding J's though. So I looked through my size, I couldn't really find anything. The best thing I'm seeing right now is that I know this was a Nike Lab release right here, the Jason Kids. So these are a size eight and a half on sale for 99 instead of 160. And this was a Nike Lab release indeed. If they had these in my size and maybe one of the other colorways, I definitely would have grabbed them. But I mean, for what? 70 bucks the jason kids the flights i mean and it's a nike lab release so you already know the quality is correct i'm gonna just let y'all see that real quick all nike labbed out this is the best shoe i've seen so far i mean the jays are cool but i probably cop these before i cop the jays other than that they still have a couple pair of the kd nines sitting around the kd elites they had these the first time i came from the store and they are now 100 bucks instead of 150 with that 30 percent makes them 70 bucks frugal voice i'm doing that quick mass quick mass okay hold on hold on I was, I was talking shit for a little bit talked a little bit of that then and then blam flynets royal flynets on the shelf at the outlets still regular price but still return pair y'all seen it on camera bro i'll make it up and not only do they have royal flynets on the shelf of the I just dropped one. Not only do they have those, they have what I think, I'm pretty sure these are the John Elliott Vandals right here. Another limited release, usually 150 on sale for 99 plus 30% off. I don't know if the Royal Flynet one sold out because I don't think the breads really did. So this still, this is a good deal. A few moments later. All right, y'all, so I did a little bit more digging. I found a couple pairs of some cozy pants, tech fleece and regular running stuff. And we did run across these guys. Listen, small feet, small foot guys. Y'all got all the juice at this outlet. Big feet, y'all gang, we're struggling, bro. But as I was trying to say, man, I can't really find too much for myself. It's a lot more smaller sizes. I got a couple extra coupons and gift cards for my family so i'm gonna probably pass those out to them they still do have these and y'all know i didn't sleep i already copped a couple pairs of these when i was out and what was it anaheim so if you want these they got a couple pairs size 10 probably one of the uh one of the better things i found this time so this time no shoes for the kid only pants but i'll take them dreams with george and dunce capping and kazooing i would just assume you keep the coke moving but i got one question yeah y'all been doing all right y'all so we came we saw and we somewhat conquered but your boy still did walk away with that nike bag nike bag with the nike swooshes too many swooshes in this frame right now so listen i need to get out of here i got a couple more things i need to do before i leave i want to get some more work done and um i'm gonna see y'all in a few i think i actually might run to a thrift or two i might keep that in this video i might not so i guess y'all gonna see in a second so uh yeah I guess I'll be right back. Later that same evening. And we are back in the studio. Listen, like I said, bruh, I'm gonna go through some of the stuff I got from round two and today's blessings right here. Nike bag, round two red bag. So first up, and Nike, sadly, they weren't showing any love to the Big Feet gang, the Yacht gang in there. A lot of the small sizes between like eight and a half to nine and a half had some pretty good deals in there. So all I did was walk away with uh, three three pairs of pants for the fall. That, that's literally it. And first up out of the Nike bag, I get a lot of questions about a specific pair of black pants that you guys see me wear. And they're just some black Nike dry fit like type pants. They're just all over gray. This is about as similar as I could find to them. And they're very, very lightweight. I think these are like runner's pants. And you guys can see the zipper down on the bottom. These are just straight up cozy pickups. Nothing really special. So throw those on my shoulder. And then I pick these up as well. These are like that same similar style, just a little bit heavier of a pant. 
and they're just nice track pants and stuff just to wear when you're just running out or when you don't want to wear jeans but you do want to wear pants and you don't want to wear like a tech fleece or something heavy you can just throw these on and these are pretty similar to the uh, pair that I already had that a lot of people ask me about with the zippers on them so check out your local Nike factories so here's a tag maybe there's some info up here that you guys can use to actually find them but these are both $60 each plus I had that third percent off and I went ahead and picked these up as well they had a really dope like Nike tech fleece parka but it was still at 175 it retail only was 250 so I passed on it but I did pick up like these navy blue tech fleece pants you can never have enough tech fleece especially when fall is around the corner these will not be worn anytime soon though because like I say it's still 70 around here so those are the three quick pickups from Nike unfortunately we did not come away with any kicks this time no blessings on the shoe side but I guess I can go ahead and we can run through this bag right here from round two with a couple more blessings first up the supreme lock box I got this one brand new had the keys inside and you guys know this is gonna just look nice in my room and you probably will see it in the background somewhere I'm not sure where I'm gonna toss it yet but the supreme lockbox you already know got that joint then I got two hats I'm not sure which season this is from um, but I've definitely seen these before now you just two all over satin snapbacks from supreme you got supreme kind of in the arc on the back and then you have the red as well and i got both of these for a really really good price and all over monochrome hats are dope and i believe this is from an older season which is always good to have some of the older stuff so all red all blue all satin clean hats definitely something that i will wear backwards like this before i wear it just with a satin front but clean in my opinion but then I also picked up these right here these are the all black Calabasas pants I picked them up in a size large these definitely do run big listen to people when they tell you that they run big the large is perfect for me I'm using a 36 waist and these fit great it's not too loose it's not too tight it's almost that perfect fit on these and y'all are pretty aware that these restocked and the prices on them dropped which is great so now somebody like me who wasn't able to grab them when they restocked or when they originally released i can get them now all black calabasas guys super cozy size large really good fit on these and then of course last up the reason i drove to richmond y'all know what it is man y'all should have seen the video by now shouts out once again to everybody that peeped that video the all black supreme up tempo so now the trifecta is complete i have all black gold and red so i'm good i told y'all eventually i was going to get them i almost gave up i almost lost hope i didn't think the delay w was going to happen but lo and behold shout out to everybody that tagged me on the round two post y'all see them delay w's on deck you already know so anyways man that is going to be it i need to get out of here much love to all the fam followers and of course supporters you guys can follow me on instagram twitter soundcloud snapchat the snapchat is bold i see by the way here there blah blah, blah of course bullet rc and i will see y'all on the next video make sure y'all finesse the bell and tune in complex con this weekend videos will be dropping get ready all right i told you complex con i'll be there so yeah finesse the bell y'all be easy i'm out peace Tyrex stirs turned into Cavalli furs. The full length cat when I wave the kitty purrs. All my n caked up, selling gray and beige dust. Had that money right or end up in the trunk taped up. We don't chase a duck, we only race for bucks. Peel money rolls till our thumbs get.